I just made a new deck. I'm going to try this again. I want to try to work out something where I can use righteousness. Uh, maybe reverse damage. So this is called defensive tactics. Um, I have some death ward. I have holy armor. I have piety. I've never played with this card before. Uh, it's light on creatures, I would say, but it, I guess it just thrives on allowing the opponent to attack and then reacting in some way, whether it's reverse damage, piety, death ward, uh, pumping one of your creatures with holy armor. So I'm going to run with this. We'll see how it does. Let's go exit the deck builder. Again, if you ever want to play MTG Shandalar, you can buy it for like 20 bucks on eBay, or even cheaper, like 10, 20 bucks on eBay. Uh, or you can, there's abandoned wear websites where you can find this uh, program and you can buy it there. You'll need to use um, a program. I'm using like an emulator for Windows 95. I'm using something called VMware. Uh, and that's it. That's all you got to do. And you can play Vintage Magic like this, which is a lot of fun because it's hard to find people uh, that still want to play. I, I just like it. Um, there's an old school NTG podcast. Uh, I think it's picking up steam, old school NTG, but they play like 93, 94. Uh, okay, what am I doing? It's hard to talk and play at the same time. Random deck, defensive tactics, lay and wait was the last deck I was playing. It didn't do very good at all. Um, I don't know. I like playing with white. First of all, because it's good, but also because it's like it represents, you know, it's the opposite. It's black's bad, white's good. Of course, Wizards has tried to get away from that in uh, modern. But um, I also like it because it's kind of the underdog. Um, I know these days it's known for white weenie defensive tactics. Okay. But yeah, it's kind of the underdog. It's kind of always fun, I think, to win with uh, it's a more fun win condition. Shapeshifter. I'll play first. Ooh, only got one land. That's not good. It's okay, we'll run with it. I guess I should have drew first instead of played first. When I'm playing with white, a defensive deck. But we'll see how this game goes. I appreciate everybody that watches these videos. I realize I don't make the best videos on YouTube, but uh, I just enjoy it. So please comment, like, subscribe helps the channel and it uh, encourages me to continue making videos but I really do appreciate it okay got my Samite healer out there flavor text healers ultimately acquire the divine gifts of spiritual and physical wholeness hold on can't read the rest of that expand the text box there we go Healers ultimately acquire the divine gifts of spiritual and physical wholeness. The most devout are also granted the ability to pass physical wholeness on to others. Okay. Can't believe I'm attacking with a semi healer, but. That's the way this game's going. Be beautiful artwork there on the Sarah Angel. Born with wings of light and a sword of faith, this heavenly incarnation embodies both fury and purity. Urza's Avenger, minus one, minus one, banding, flying, first strike, or trample on two in your turn. Okay, I think I can deal with that. Here's where... That's a beautiful artwork. Damien Willich or Willick. All damage dealt to you so far this turn from one source is retroactively added to your life total instead of subtracted. Treat further damage from that source normally. It might take me a couple times because I don't know when you play that. I mean, in a normal game, you play it and you say, hey, everything has been done to me so far. I reverse it. But, uh, let's see, one, three. Uh, but with the computer, I don't know when's the appropriate time to play that.
Maybe you can play it near the end. For each one damage dealt to you by enchanting creature by. Okay. Hmm. Didn't attack. Oh, well, I got my this guy. But you could have made it a flying creature. Still got one mana for my. For my reverse damage if I need it. Yeah, he probably just doesn't want to tap it. Or I could give myself block with both of those and give him plus zero, plus three to kill his little assembly worker there. Um, sorry, I'm trying to figure this out. I've never... I'm going to take it and then try to play. I guess you can play reverse damage now. So it should put me at 22 after that resolves. Okay. So now I know how to play that card. I've never played that reverse damage before. So I don't know when the appropriate time was. I don't think you could play it now. I think you have to play it in that phase. Like in the combat phase before they move here. Anyway. Okay. Time to bring out the big guns. I thought I double clicked it, but I guess not. Here we go. Now we're rolling. And he'll have to do minus one, minus one if he wants to give that flying. Otherwise, I can use a damage prevention on my Sarah Angel. He's got a lot of mana there, fellow our stone. What does that do again? Add one mana of any type. So, one of my planes. Okay. Ooh, now he's really hurting. Two Sarah Angels. He has to do minus one, minus one to make it flying to block. I shouldn't have played that second one. I should have waited. You should always play your creatures in your second main phase for the most part. And he takes it. Love that. Doesn't even have to tap. What a beautiful creature. Beautiful artwork as well. Douglas Schuler. 
remember on alpha i think it's alpha and beta cards they even they misspelled his name with a c in there for Schuler. okay another planes piety is only for blocking this time i'll do what i said i was going to do and wait until this is second main phase to play my creature He's got to make that flying and block one of these, I would think. Guess not. Guess not. Yeah, I, for, I even forget. <laughs> there I go. Forgetting to play my Samite Healer in my second main phase. Oh, boy. That's all right. Another piety. Wow. Stuck in a loop or something? There we go. Boom. Ah, almost got to play my personal incarnation. Maybe next game. Maybe next game. See my healer. Hey, thanks for watching. Oh, I'll play another game with this. So this deck is doing much better than my previous deck. And uh, this Shapeshifter opponent deck isn't even one of mine. So that's a computer deck. Um, but I will play again with this deck and uh, see how it does. Hopefully I get a personal incarnation on the, on the battlefield next game. Thanks for watching.